Howdy folks, so welcome to episode 7 of Railroads Online. We're going to do some more building over here, and we're going to go from here, and if you recall, we did their, our path through the woods this way. It looks like it's a fairly even thing, so what we can do is we can basically run through this. I think we can run, basically, we're going to try to run a line that goes like this way and so that's going to be the plan let's go back and we'll start at that end now they did release a couple of things between last episode that i did in this episode there was a couple of releases uh, one of them was on the baby branch but it was like really minor stuff uh wasn't even worth mentioning as far as like it's not going to affect any anything the way we build or anything it was just a couple like you know they fixed the hit boxes or something like that um but most of it was just, you know, the trains and the old thing. They're working on that. So anyway, they did another. Let's get this. Let's get this working, and I can talk while we're doing this. Let's see if we can go like this. And our incline is zero. See, I think I might need to. Um, there. We're gonna go like this. I think I might need to uh, change the incline. Yeah, it looks like the incline is going to be... Okay, so I think what we'll do is we'll take... Um, why don't we take some groundwork and we'll see what we need to do as far as getting our incline here. So we're going to start here, right? And we're going to go this way. So we need to come up... Let me see, what is that going to be? Is that... E and Q, yeah. So we'll go like this. Because where is the lowest point? You know what we also, also need to do is we need to go options, graphics. We're going to change the foliage here. Back, continue. Okay, there we go. Now we can actually do this. So let's see what's the lowest we can get away with. Because we don't, yeah, okay, we can't get away with, whoops, 0.5. Okay, so it looks like 0.5 to here, right? And let's see if, let's see if zero, let's see if zero is going to let us do this whole thing. Whoops, it just disappeared there. And I think that's just because of length, not because of, not because of uh, which call it. So anyway, they did the um, they did an update, and so they also did, you know, the update where all the train cars were. Remember when I switched from the public to the beta branch because the train cars all like exploded, um, or I started a new world because all the train cars exploded. So they did that update, but they put it on the main branch. So everybody who had stuff on their map it got exploded and you remember where it just basically it did the you know it did that that type of thing right um to all of their cars so <laughs> i guess i'm glad i you know switched when i did so that i didn't end up with you know that that issue okay so this is going to come over here it looks like it's going uphill doesn't it it looks like we're going uphill, but we're not losing any ground here. So we're going to try to curve to this. And we're basically just going to use this as kind of our guide. There it is. And then this is going to go... I think there's a little bit of a hill here. Maybe there isn't. Okay. So we're going to go like this. And then, um, let me see. Yeah, see, we're going to go like this. There we go. It looks like it's actually, the ground is getting lower instead of getting higher, right? Okay, and then that's going to be the ironworks. It's going to be the next thing, right? I think. Because the oil, the oil is like the second to last thing, isn't it? Okay. And I think once we're on that, this is all level to here. So we're good for that. Okay. So anyway, yeah, they did that. <laughs> they did that update, and I'm sure they're 
you know, people are raging about that or whatever. <laughs> I can't blame them for being mad about that, but yeah. Um, so anyway, let's start with our three foot rail and we need to go a couple degrees more this way, I think. There we go. Okay, so one of the other things they did, they put out a roadmap and it looks like, um, it looks like the, is this really gonna, oh, the incline, that's interesting. Oh, because the incline was like that before. Okay, so our incline was 0.5 up to where? You know what, we're gonna delete this first segment because it was only the first segment that was like that, right? So now we know how far we need to go 0.5 and then we can just stop going up from there, right? So let's go like this, this. We're gonna start this about here. There we go. So one of the other things they did was the um, procedural Let's go like, yeah, 0. 0.5 is, I think, the limit. Okay. It doesn't do quarters now. So anyway, the, um, <laughs> I keep losing my, my uh, place where I was going to, I was going to mention. Okay, we need to go back down to zero. There we go. Okay. We can put this in here and see, we can go a long way with this now, which is really cool right and then we can go like this i'm curious to see how far we can go with this there we go let's see how that looks oh that's beautiful that's beautiful like that okay and we'll keep coming this way and we could probably even yeah see we can make it come out a little bit more even so oh what they did was um for the procedural switches are not going to be part of this blind update. The procedural switches are going to be um, are going to be after they go to early they come out of early access. That is, so yeah, just FYI, that's so we're going to have to um, we're going to have to build our switches in. We're going to have to build using the other switches because we're not going to be able to use them the way they are. Now, I think that means that the cross pieces will be, let's see if, if we do this, can we go like this? Yeah, I think we can. We can get around this corner by doing this. Okay, cool. But yeah, the cross pieces, you know, um, where you can cross two tracks like at an angle other than 90, I'm hoping they're going to, the procedural crossings or whatever they call them, but I'm hoping those are going to be uh, part of the spline update and not something we're gonna have to do later. Okay, let's see if that if we put it here Okay, we need to go like this a little bit There we go and then we can get this to around here And I think this is gonna be level with this. Yeah, cool and this should be Let's see what angle that's gonna be at See what angle is is going to be. Did, wasn't that like a downhill? That used to be a downhill. Remember, when we came into here, we had to come downhill from it. I don't know. Let's see what angle this is. Let's see if we get the. We need to get the rails on this because that'll tell us much better, right? And it looks like, yeah, it looks like 270. Okay. So if we come all the way up to here. See, the one concern I have is if we go all the way across here like this, then we might run into something where we need to change this track out or put in a switch or whatever it is. So I'm kind of hesitant to come all the way down to here at this point. But I think what we can do is we can come out like this. We'll leave some space for a couple switches, right? So like this, and then we can put our track. We're gonna put another sec section segment here. And we'll do this, right? Because that'll leave us room for that. There we go. And then this should be our 270. Should be nice and even like this, right? 
like that. Okay, and then what we need to do is we need to come up with our radius again, right? So we're going to come out here a little bit first, and then we'll do our circle. And I think we probably should do the same sort of thing that we did last time where we put a switch on here. So why don't we just start with that. We're going to go switch left. Is it going to let me... I don't remember if... Oh, we do have switch lefts. Okay, yeah, we do have different switches. Okay, cool. All right. And then we're going to come around this thing. So let's go... Let's measure this. All right, we're just going to take this. We're going to go to zero. And we're going to measure the distance here. Where is our circle mode? Like that, right? So that'll tell us how many meters we have. And that's going to go to there. So let's say 60 meters is going to be our radius or our diameter. So from here, we need to go back to 30, 30 meters, right? So that's our 30 meter. And then we're going to go this way to 270. See, they gave us survey tools, right? Okay, so we're going to go like this. And we're going to go out 30 meters. Okay, so did I just, yeah, I got stuck on the track or whatever. Okay, so that's where our thing needs to go. That's where our inside track needs to go. So we're going to link onto this. We're going to go in circle mode. And we're going to go like this. Um, let me see. Which radius is that? Let's go like, which one would do we do to edit our construction grid? Okay. Let's go like this. Yeah, that's what we need to do. All right. So that's our grid. Let's do our grid back to one so that we can do this right and our radius see we can make our radius whatever we want so we're gonna go um, curve radius there we go should we go up to 40 let's try going up to 40 and why does that seem like it's not right is it just me, or does it seem like that's not complete? It's not at like a 90. Let's see. Maybe we do have to go back to 30. Or 35. We'll try that. We're going to go like this. And we're going to connect to it. And we're going to do another 35. Right? And that's going to come out too far, isn't it? Yeah, it is. It's going to come out way too far. All right. So I think we do need to make it 30. That's why we need to make it 30. Okay. So we're going to delete rails. And we're going to start again on this. And we're going to go to our 30. Like this. Wow. Radius 30. Let's see if we can get this to see if we can get it to come on. I'm trying to get it halfway through there, but it's you know what I mean. <laughs> All right, that's close enough. And let's get rid of this, and then we'll put our second one on here. And we'll see if we can get this to line up. Like right there. Looks like it's about lined up, doesn't it? All right. So that should be like that. And then what we can do is we can hook this on here. And then we go back out of circle mode. And we'll go back to 90. 
Oh, and we need to put our thingy into there, too. We need to put our switch back in here, don't we? Okay, so we're going to put another switch on here. Yeah, let's let's put in our track first. We'll get it all connected, and then we'll delete our segment that we're putting in here. So this segment's going to get deleted. It just needs to get... Is this 90? Does 90 actually line up with this? Yeah, it seems like it does. Okay, so our track is going to come up to here. And... <laughs> and then I'm stuck in the ground. Okay, so let's get this one up here first. And then we can worry about where it's going. And now let's go to circle mode. And we're going to go back to... Uh, 9.30. There. Okay, we're going to make that straight. Alright, and then we can delete the segment that we're standing on. There we go. Because we need to put a switch here anyway, right? Cool. So we need to get our switch. And that's going to be a switch right. And we need to rotate that to 270. Like that. There we go. Okay, so I think what we can do is we can make this one match better. Definitely. Okay, so let's get rid of this. And then we can go back to here and do our... Um, we're going to go to that. There we go. And we're going to go to circle mode again. And we're going to get our radius to uh, down to 30 again. And we'll see what we need to... Whoops, let's go like this. It looks like 31. Yeah, see, it looks like about like that. Can we... Yeah, we can crouch. Get this lined up really nicely, can't we? Look at that. So that should do it, right? I'm not sure if it actually poofed in where I had it set to. And can we link it to there? Will it let us... Will it let us link? Alignment. Let's go like this. Let's see if it'll let us... There we go. Okay. There we go. Alright. And that's a nice... Wow. We managed to make something bad. <laughs> we managed to make a bad piece of track on here. So what is the... I think it's because it went a little bit too far. Yeah, it went a little bit too far. Okay, we're going to try again. We're going to try again. There we go. We're going to try again on that. So let's go like this. And we're going to go to circle. You know, we could do this. We could try this anyway. See what it does. It actually looks like it works pretty well there, doesn't it? Let's compare that to the... Um, yeah, I can't really compare that to the circular piece, can I? Okay. All right, so anyway, we've got our switch out there. We can put our double track on there. So let's see if we can get that to work. Um, let's go like this. We're going to put that out here. And then we're going to go to circle mode. And we'll try... going like this let's let's uh, bring this back to I think that's more like it closer it's getting closer there 37 it's hard to tell because it doesn't want to 36 let's try 36. Yeah, I think 36 or maybe even 35. Yeah, it looks like 35 is going to be about right. Okay. 
because we want to kind of be lined up with that other piece there. 34. Okay, let's do that. And then we're going to do this other piece, and we're going to see if we can get this to come in and hook up with this. Hook up with this. 33. And let's see if we can do 32 is way too. We can't do like 32 and a half now. Okay. All right. And then let's get this. See if we can get it close. If we can't, we'll do it like we did on the, on the inside. We'll do the spline thing again. But it looks like it's about lined up, doesn't it? And then we'll hook up this. Take off that mode, and can you connect? I saw it. I saw it. Do the link. Where's the link? It had the link there. There it is. All right. How's that? It's not awful. That's actually yeah. That's actually pretty good. Okay. Cool. And then these are set to go on the inside. Not that we're going to be running a train around it anytime soon. And then this one is set. We need to set this one to go to the inside. There we go. Okay. Cool. And then we can get rid of this piece here. There we go. See if my tea is drinkable yet. Yes, it is. <laughs> cool. And then what we need to do is coming out of here, we need to make another, I think I want to do another loop, right? I like having those loops around the, around the, uh, these things so that you can go back and forth or do whatever you need to do. So I think that's what we're going to do. So we're going to take this out and we're going to demolish this other piece that's right over here. Does that just go, that doesn't go this whole distance, does it? We just did a little piece right here, didn't we? Yeah, perfect. Okay, so we want to do a switch left. Whoops, we want to do the other switch left. We're going to do this switch left. And then over on this side, we're going to do the switch right. Okay, so we need to get our piece to come up to the very end. Get our track to come up to the end. There, 90. We're going to have this all the way to the end. And we can actually just put this on... There we go. We'll put that on straight. We'll put it on circle mode and go straight. 50 meters. Okay. So we'll get out of there. We want to come parallel to that one. So about like this. I think that's about right. And then we're going to put in our switch. So we'll put in our switch right. like that and then we should be able to connect these two so let's just go like this again we're gonna do our radius of 33 or whatever it is there we go let's see what we can get done here I think it's about right here isn't it See, I don't know how close we can get to to this. Where's it go? Look at that. So that's 30. So 30 it looks like it's going to hit the outside. Let's see. What if we go like this? Will it? No, it won't move. Okay, so let's go like this. Get it to come up there. And now let's do this and see if we can 
See, what, see, it's going to match up with the outside if we do a radius of 30. So we are going to have to do it um, a little bit. Let me see. We can't go sharper. So we're going to go this way, and then we're going to do, you're going to use a spline to finish it up. So let's go like this. And then we're going to use a spline. Yeah, see, that's our 30s going there. So let's switch to spline mode. Go back to this. It looks like that's the right angle, the correct angle. And we'll hook that up and we'll see what kind of curve that gives us. I don't know, it may be overly sharp or it may not. I don't know honestly don't know okay and then the other thing we're going to need to do is like we did before is we're going to have a switch going off to the right on here so let's just put our switch let's see we want the switch we want this one and then we're going to go back to 90 degrees is that what it was Ninety degrees. There we go. All right, and then it looks like we should be able to connect this. Did I get stuck again? <laughs> I totally got stuck. All right, let's try that again. <laughs> go like this. Is it going to let me put it in there? How's that looking? There we go. It's just the tiniest little... Because this, this section here is like a mile long, right? So I don't want to break that one just yet. Okay, and we can clean up this groundwork here. Let's clean up this stuff. And then what we need to do is we need to make a switch on this. Where's my groundwork? There it is. We need to make a switch that's gonna that's gonna let us go that way too. So we'll have to see where that can come in. But actually, I think we are out of time for today. I don't wanna go too long on this one. There we go. But yeah, that's gonna be it for episode seven. Join me in episode eight, and we'll see if we can get this little triangle hooked up. Maybe, we've got a lot of room here. Maybe we can even make like a little siding or something like that and you know put a put a put something in there a turnaround or whatever but i don't think there's a good reason to have a turnaround there so maybe not but why is this so high up in the air and the other thing isn't did i forget to turn off the the elevation or what is it is it at 0.5 the whole time because it seems to be going way higher seems to go way higher up, doesn't it? That's weird. Okay. But yeah, anyway, that is going to be it for Episode 7. Join me in Episode 8, and we'll see you then. Later.